Hi there, and welcome to Pivotal Tracker. Over the next few short videos, we're going to walk you through the concepts behind Pivotal Tracker, a powerful yet simple to use project management tool for software teams. Tracker helps teams like yours organize their work in a simple, transparent way. It helps you focus on what you're actually doing, how far along you are into a project, and what's left to do. We built Tracker because tools should make managing projects easier, rather than creating more work. These videos will focus on the process behind using Tracker and its features, so that you can understand the best way to effectively manage and collaborate on your projects. The Pivotal Tracker process includes breaking your project down into stories, estimating their complexity and prioritizing them, developing and delivering stories, and finally, accepting stories and tracking your project's velocity. Together, these steps make up a basic iteration. Usually, an iteration takes one week. In this video, let's focus on the first step, getting to know Tracker's basic interface and breaking your project down into stories. So let's open up Tracker and create a new project. Now that you're in, you'll see the main organizational panels, the current iteration, the backlog, and the icebox. Current shows you the stories your team has started working on and any additional stories that can fit in the iteration according to your project velocity. The backlog holds stories you aren't working on but have prioritized to do next. The icebox is where you store all of your features and ideas throughout the course of the project. The product owner prioritizes these into the backlog during the project. You can think of current as the top of the overall backlog and can optionally combine them by clicking the link button at the bottom of the panels. At the beginning of a project, before any coding begins, the product owner and developers collect features and requirements. How detailed should these be? Pretty general. You'll want to be able to keep these high level, and they should be able to fit on an index card. Your team will typically write the bulk of these ideas in your initial planning session and add them to Tracker. Adding them to Tracker involves turning these ideas into stories. A story is the basic unit of work used in Pivotal Tracker. It's important to write your stories so that they are discreet and actionable. For example, imagine that your team wants to build an app to locate burrito vendors around San Francisco. A story that says burrito locator should be refined into a story like, as a user, I can see nearby burrito stands on a map. Stories can continue to be added and edited over the course of a project. Now that you've written and added your stories to the icebox, you're ready for step two. In the next video, we'll cover the difference between the backlog and current panel and how to estimate and prioritize stories. Check it out at www.pivotaltracker.com.